Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Tuesday and I am about to go outside and get my tan on. Coating my whole body first in this sun bum and then I like to spray a little bit of tanning oil over top. That way my skin is still protected but I'm still able to get like the best possible tan. I spent pretty much my whole morning editing this long random vlog that I wasn't even sure that I was going to post because it's literally like four days four or five days actually worth of vlog footage that is just so random like bits and pieces from parts of my day and this was leading up to finals before I took that whole week without uploading so it's very very random footage and I honestly wasn't going to upload it which is why now that I made the decision to upload it it's going up so much later and out of order um but here it is I decided I would just upload it because I realized that it was a lot more footage than I thought and I figured if I even asked, you guys would probably say, yeah, go ahead and upload it. I have my camera literally sitting on a Sephora box and my Brazilian bum bum cream while I put this sunscreen on. But I love this sunscreen so much. I've talked about it before. It's always like the more expensive option when you go to buy sunscreen. But the reason that I love it so much is because I hate the feeling of sunscreen normally. Like it's very greasy and I just hate that greasy feeling that it leaves and this stuff literally spreads in so evenly it feels like you're just putting lotion on and then once it dries it's done it doesn't feel like you have anything on your skin except for a really good coconut beachy smelling lotion the other day i posted an instagram story sharing a frappuccino that i made because i'm just all about experimenting with coffee this entire quarantine i have tried probably every coffee creation and so the latest thing is frappuccinos and i've only made it twice but both times it turned out really good for being just like at home obviously not as good as at starbucks but really good and really refreshing for when you're laying out in the sun so i thought i would make one and show you guys how i make it so i'm just using my nutribullet to make it, but you can probably do it in any blender that you want so I just filled it up with about this much ice and I'm gonna do two tablespoons of instant coffee so very similar to like the whipped coffee and then I'm gonna do one tablespoon of sugar and then some oat milk half and half and then I'm just gonna do like a splash of this French vanilla I wish I had measurements for you guys but I will show you about how much I'm putting in I honestly just make it a little different every time and if I blend it up and it's too thick I just take the lid off and add a little more until I get it to the consistency that I want The consistency should look something like this and if it doesn't then you might need to just add a little bit more milk or a little more ice um, but this is kind of how it looks and then you stir it up and pour it in a glass. So here's what the final product looks like. It's so yummy and easy to make. So let me know if you guys try this. This is honestly my favorite pastime these days, just tanning outside on my deck. Got my frappuccino and my new speakers. So this is perfect. And this is the tanning oil that I like to put over top of my sunscreen just to make my legs super shiny and attract the sun. So I just came inside from being outside for a couple of hours. I don't want to overdo it because it does get really hot out there, but I definitely am getting some tan lines. It is now way later. I came in after tanning and I ate a giant salad for lunch, took a shower, washed my hair, blow dried it, and now I'm just hanging out. Chad just got home. He went kayaking this morning. Super jealous. He went with one of his friends and I haven't been kayaking in so long. I really wish that I had a kayak. I love kayaking, but it's just been a while for me. But since it's Cinco de Mayo, I changed into my shirt that's very fitting for Cinco de Mayo. We got our tacos. They look so freaking good. Same little local restaurant that we got them from before. They're Mexican street tacos. And we got pork, chicken, and shrimp. So it's the next morning. It's 9.22 to be exact. 
and Chad and I are about to go do a workout this morning and just get it over with for the day. So I thought I would just share with you guys my work outfit. Every single time I wear this bra, I always get asked where it's from because it's like high neck and long lines. So it's super supportive if you're doing like HIIT workouts or running or anything like that. Um, and it's called the ebb to b bra i know that's really weird but it's by lululemon and i'll link it in the description it is the most supportive bra that i own and then i'm wearing these like cheetah print aligned leggings from lululemon as well and these are probably one of my favorite pairs of aligns i just love the print that's on them uh and then i'm just gonna wear my adidas cloud foam sneakers and that's my work outfit so let's go get our workout on and get this day started. So here is what our workout is consisting of today. Chad came up with this based on uh, the app that they use at CrossFit. So this is like a CrossFit sort of workout. Um, so we're gonna do three rounds of this, four rounds of this. We're gonna run a lap after that one and then run a lap after this one. Um, and this is like full body, lots of arms and core, a little bit of legs. I am a sight to see right now, but <laughs> we just finished our workout and I'm gonna make a protein smoothie. I have lots of bags of frozen fruit. shower and obviously it beach waved my hair I am so obsessed with that beach waver it gives my hair so much volume like it takes it from just being flat and boring to like looking really thick and full so I'll link it again it's this one pink it's so cute it works so good if you guys want to check it out it's really good I love it but now I'm just sitting here at my computer drinking some lemon water and I don't have any schoolwork to do which is so freaking weird but uh, I'm actually just working on planning out some content for the next coming months. I'm working with my manager to just plan out some sponsored content as well as just content that I want to get out for you guys, like things that you have sent me and DMs and stuff that you want to see. I know office tour is one of the main things that everybody keeps asking for um, and I'm definitely doing it. I have my office pretty much exactly how I want it. The only thing that is missing is these are coming in today. I told you guys I was getting like new baskets for my little cube organizer and then the other thing I'm waiting for is something that I'm putting up on the wall, but then I'll be ready to do the office tour. So that will be coming very soon. I don't know if I want to make it just like a separate video or include it in a vlog. So let me guys, let me know if you guys want me to do like just like a feature in a vlog or a whole dedicated video that's just the office tour and get like more detailed into everything. Guys, my little baskets came in that I got for my cubicle. So I'm going to unbox them with you guys. And I found these on the container store. I found the kind of what I was looking for a couple different places, but they were kind of expensive. So I found these ones at the container store and they were actually like the most reasonably priced. what I wanted so here's what they look like perfect little cubes to go right into my little cubicle thing so here's how they look I really really like it they're a little bit different colors but I kind of like it I feel like it gives it I don't know some variation makes it look more natural so they're not exactly identical these are the ones that i got from target because i wanted to get rid of those pink ones and i thought these were going to do the trick for me but i really did not like the way these looked either so i just decided to go with like regular baskets and then i also ordered a sports bra from lululemon and it's actually one that i literally already have i just ordered another one because it's my favorite sports bra it's the invigorate bra Here's what it looks like. I wear this one all the time, but I do just really like it. It's got like this mesh detailing in the back and it's just like a typical sports bra. And then this last package is actually another PR package from Pixi. I freaking love Pixi products, obsessed with 
everything. I use their stuff all the time. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. The prettiest little thing ever. And it says my name in here so cute and like it hangs up so like whenever you go on vacation or you're at like a hotel or something you can hang it up and have all of your skincare in here so let's see we have the retinol jasmine cleanser this is awesome because i love the milk makeup cleanser it's like my favorite thing ever we got another tonic is this a glow toner or is this a new one Ooh, a retinol tonic okay this is new jasmine oil blend overnight retinol oil retinol jasmine lotion and retinol eye cream yes i use the sephora eye cream right now and it's almost out so this is perfect can't wait to try this stuff i'll let you guys know i feel like i already saw this collection at target so it must be available at target now so let you guys know what i think this is the cutest though the time has finally come for me to do my nails i am tired of these ratchet nails so i decided i'm gonna paint them and i'm just gonna use regular nail polish but since i do have my uv light and i have a top coat that's gel i'm gonna put a gel top coat and see how that works i've never actually tried to do that we're gonna attempt this let's hope it turns out good so here's what the color looks like i did two coats my nails do not look the prettiest because i'm not a nail tech and it's like a really pretty sheer pink so now i'm gonna add the top coat and then i'm gonna cure them under the light Okay, here's the great reveal. I think they turned out really, really cute for just doing them at home, and I haven't done my nails like this in a long time. So I love it. I will link this. Uh, it's from Amazon if it's still available. I got this a long time ago, but I will link it, and I'll also link the gel top coat that I used because it worked good, and I don't really have to worry about them getting messed up right away because of the gel, so... I love it. I literally just spent like the last hour linking everything on Instagram. I always get questions of like, what am I wearing or where's something from? And so I just like, I linked a bunch of things from some questions I had in DMs. And then I asked you guys to ask me if you wanted any other links and it has blown up. So I just sat here linking everything and there's still so much more, but I'm trying to link it all because I know how it is when you really want to know where something's from because I watch YouTubers as well and I look at influencers and bloggers and people on Instagram and I always want to know where things they have is from too. So I'm just trying to link it. So if you're not following me on Instagram, be sure to because I do try really hard to get back to linking things when you guys ask me where things are from. Here is what we're having for dinner tonight. Chad just cooked all of this up. I have been in my room linking things on Instagram um, but we're having shrimp zucchini bowls so we're having shrimp with rice as the base zucchini and some scallions so we're gonna squeeze a lemon on top so Chad went to Lowe's earlier today and he found pretty much the exact wall shelves that I have been hunting for so many of you guys have messaged me and sent me links and like places that I could find them and stuff. A lot of you guys actually suggested Home Depot and Lowe's. So I was really shocked. He found exactly what I'm looking for. 36 inches, so they are longer and the brackets are really cool looking. So we're gonna put these up. I am really, really excited. We got our shelves up. Here's what they look like. Can't wait to find some stuff to decorate them with. And then this little spot on the wall, I'm gonna hang something. I don't know what. It is a while later. It's actually almost 10 o'clock and I just realized that I need to self tan tonight. So I'm gonna go hop in the shower and exfoliate and self tan, but I am gonna end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.